listen up, because what's happening beneath the melting Arctic sea ice is a massive scientific revelation. For decades, we thought the vital process of nitrogen fixation, where microorganisms convert nitrogen gas into the usable nitrogen needed for life, was a no-show in the Arctic. Why? Because the known players, the cyanobacteria, prefer warmer water. But new research published in the journal Communications and Environment proves that nitrogen fixation is happening. Even under the freezing ice, scientists found active nitrogen fixation in both the central Arctic Ocean and the marginal ice zones. In the most dynamic areas, next to rapidly melting sea ice, fixation rates hit their peak, reaching up to 5.3 nanomoles of nitrogen per liter per day. The work reveals that non-cyanobacterial diazotrophs, or NCDs, are the main microbes behind this process. These are not the usual suspects. They're tiny, energy-hungry organisms whose activity is actually powered by organic matter leaking out of phytoplankton blooms that happen when the sea ice melts. It's an indirect but powerful link. Melting ice leads to phytoplankton blooms. Those blooms release food for the NCDs. The NCDs then fix nitrogen, which fuels more primary production. It's a microbial feedback loop. This means nitrogen fixation is likely a much bigger deal for Arctic ecosystems than anyone predicted, playing a critical role in supporting new life as the sea ice rapidly declines. Please like and subscribe for more science news.